All right, once again with this question, we're gonna solve by factoring. And we know that's a good option because I don't have, um, I have a 14N here, so I can't use the square root method. All right, I made a little mistake on the paper that the answer piece, so I wanna make sure you take a look at this. So to solve this by factoring, I'm gonna, I, because there's a number here, I have to multiply A times C. So three times five is 15. I have to do this the long way. The factors of 15, one and 15, uh, three and five. This tells me my signs are different and the bigger one is negative. So which combination is gonna get me to negative 14? It's gonna be this one right here. So remember, when you have to do it the long way, you have to go from three terms to four terms. So I'm gonna rewrite this right here. I'd like to put my negative first. It just makes it a little bit easier. All right, and this whole thing equals zero. So it's good that it equals zero. Now I have to divide it in half. I look for the GCF here, which is gonna be three N, which gives me, which gives me N minus five. I look for my GCF here. Even though I don't have one, I have to pull something out. So I'm gonna go ahead and make it a one. And now I do my regrouping. So I have three N plus one. I write the stuff that's on the outside. I put them together. Those, those should always be the same. And so I put those. So right now I have factored, but the instructions should have said solve by factoring, which means I have to actually say what the answers are. Where does it go through the X? So I'm gonna put this, set that parentheses equal to zero, just like we did in the last problem, set that one equal to zero, and now I'm gonna solve it. Subtract one on both sides to get N by itself. Divide by three. So N equals negative one third and n equals five. So those are my two solutions. n equals negative one third and n equals five. So if I have a parabola, I know it's a happy face because that is positive and it's gonna go through negative one third and negative five, wherever that is, one, two, three, four, five, and then I have a parabola, okay? So my solutions are negative one third and, neg and positive five.